So, 14 years later, what I think really keeps me going in being able to go and try to bring other people out of that darkness um, is one day I was sitting on a plane half asleep. And this is something that I, that, that I think all of us, especially really quickly, show of hands, how many people here born in Islam? Born and raised in Islam. So, how many people came to Islam? Reverts. Very small number in the room, so I'm speaking to all of you born and raised in Islam. I was sitting on a plane one day, half asleep, and for some reason, remembering I was preparing for a lecture and I was thinking about the, the hadith of the Prophet والسلام, about Allah Azza wa having written everything in a book that is only with him 50,000 years before he initiated creation. Everything that would happen. As we know, the Prophet والسلام, said the first thing Allah created was the qalam, the pin. And then he told the pin to write. The pin said, write what? He said, write everything. Everything. And then I thought to myself, you know what? Somewhere in that book, Allah wrote that you would be guided. Somewhere in that book, Allah wrote and had written that you would be guided. That you would come out from that darkness and into the light of Islam and be where you are right now. And that kind of overwhelmed me. Because now having really understood who my creator is, really understanding Allah, that Allah would consider guiding someone like me out of all of humanity is, is really a favor and a ni'mah that I, I didn't do anything to deserve. I don't do anything to continue to deserve it, but yet that guidance is still there. And so now it becomes more of an issue to me not to struggle to stay inside of Islam anymore, but to struggle each and every day to repay a debt that I can never repay to Allah. Because He's given me something that's priceless, which is guidance. And there is nothing I can do in a myriad of lifetimes to repay that debt. So every morning I wake up now with the consideration that what am I going to do today to try to repay that gift that was given to me before I was even thought of, before the creation was thought of, where Allah had written down in a book that is only with Him that I would be guided. And for all of you here in this room, Allah wrote your name in that book too. That name, your name was written in that book too. So Allah put in consideration to bring you to Islam. And I don't know what any of you have done to deserve it, but if you are like I am, we didn't do anything to deserve it. It is truly a gift. It is truly a ni'mah that was given to us. And every single day that we wake up and we're able to say, La ilaha illallah, it's another gift. And, and that's really the beautiful treasure of Islam that we try to share with the world, that it is a gift. And it was given to me 14 years ago, and I try to give it to as many people as I can. That, that's the only thing that keeps me going. If not, I don't even know what I would be doing right now. MashaAllah.